I witnessed five methods of poverty alleviation in action. Creating a small industry, usually agriculture. Creating a sustainable micro business. Relocating, moving whole villages from remote areas. Education and training. Ecological compensation for those living in ecologically vulnerable areas. And social security, medical subsidies, and direct payments to those who cannot work. At the end of 2018, there were still 16.6 .6 million people living below the line of absolute poverty. Among them, the proportion reduced to poverty or returned to poverty because of illness is as high as 40%. Thus, poverty alleviation via health care has become a primary focus of China's fight against poverty. For seven decades, improving health care has been leadership's relentless pursuit, especially after the 18th CPC National Congress in 2012. Almost 90% of medical bills of needy patients are now covered by the government, and the number of serious illnesses covered by government medical aid programs has increased to 25 types, in some places to 30. China's National Health Commission sets up clinics for endemic diseases and extends remote medical services to all county hospitals. Healthcare institutions in poverty-stricken areas have been improved. Treatment of disease has become more timely and medical expense burdens of poor families have been abated. 